Well, hey everybody, I want you to look at this big, beautiful hay field with the bales rolled on it. It was very plentiful. I believe this is the first cut. I'm pretty sure it is. It's the first harvest off of this, and it ain't going to do nothing but get better. Depending on the moisture and the water and the rain and the heat, and it'll just get better it'll be the next cut will even have more bells but i'm not going to sit here and count them bells all i can tell you is that's a lot of bells look at them all scattered out across there that's a good harvest well makes me Wonder how they're going to harvest people. Are they already harvest harvesting us? What is the process of what we've been taught as a harvest, like a rapture? And then pre-trib and then tribulations and all that mess. There's a whole nother way of seeing everything. When you see the universe inside of you and inside of everyone, and you see your, your true identity wrapped around love and forgiveness that you have learnt in your life, that is a type of harvest. When you know you can forgive yourself and forgive everybody that's ever harmed you or ever done harm, or forgive the situations, that seem to be very unpleasant in your life, whether it was perpetrated by a person or persons. Some people go their whole life and never forgive them. And that is a sad because forgiveness is the key to well beingness. And when you love yourself, which it took me quite a few years of understanding, I have to love myself. And then I can actually get on about the business of healing myself with my words, my thoughts, and my deeds. Now, I don't know whether they're teaching that in church right now, but I don't think they are. I'm not saying that's wrong or right, good or bad. But I'm saying if the people that are so-called the church leaders are telling you not to read other books about the life and times of the greatest healer among us, that walked among us, I should say, Yahshua ben Joseph, Jesus, goes by a lot of names. I just call him Jay. <laughs> if I get confused, I just say Jesus. <laughs> Start off with the J, Jesus, and um, but yes, there's all kinds of informational technologies about self healing and self awareness that's coming out in this time. Uh, one of the books I'm diving off into is the Law of One, which I've seen it for many years and listened to it and heard it, and but now I'm listening to it from a new point of view point of view and understanding what they talk about the harvest you see I'm that field and if you harvest me are you getting the field or are you getting me well <laughs> if if you I wish I could think of a good way to say this <laughs> if you see yourself in everything you've already been harvested if you see yourself in every one you've already started the harvest process of rewriting the deviant code in your DNA your cellular mys mysterious levels of intertwining with the emotional body 
and a heart-centered based love reality that we are eternal light body beings inhabiting a physical form for a very short time. Well, I could be wrong about that. I think people are being raptured every day. They're dying. And whether that's good or bad, it's not my call. I just know it's a process of what we are. Everything in this world is passing away. The temporal nature of it is illusionary in time and space. But when you live in the now, things get really good. So I just want to say that about the harvest, not knowing <laughs> anything I'm saying except the love and peace and forgiveness start start it the process of harvesting my mind and body that was stuck in 3d a dense reality of fear-based reality controlled by the airwaves and things that i didn't realize that i could turn off if it comes through the air you can turn it off <laughs> so I don't watch TV. I haven't since about the end of April or middle of April last year, and this is June the 15th now. Don't miss it. That gives me time to read these real cool books I've been reading <laughs> and listening to because I don't, I don't read out of a page. I hear it off of audio or YouTube video. That's my modality for learning who I am. It's kind of loud, but um, I'm going to let you go and tell you that I'll put a link or two in the description box about some cool videos that talk about the law of one and what they say about the harvest and then a whole nother modality for seeing that kind of similar same thing is, yeah, all right, later.